Hello friends, how are you? Today in this video, I want to share something very personal and it's about anger management and uh, how to deal with it. Basically, uh, people used to say, you know, stay calm or be nice, you know, be, uh, be very uh, gentle, be like a gentleman, you know. But does it always work and always make sense? I hardly think so. You know, it's not about being nice. It's about being in the homeostasis, okay? If I'm pinching this part and you are not screaming and instead you're just saying, oh, nothing is happening, this is going to hurt. Because if you are pinching, you say, oh, yeah, you react, right? If you get hurt, if you pinch, the same is true for anger, okay? This, the emotion of anger is extremely important to be felt. But what happens is that people suppress it, okay? They suppress it. If something said something wrong to you or something cheated on you or something bad happened, what happened? So you basically either react or you just suppress. And if you suppress this part, if you just, just ignore it, if you just keep it with yourself without reacting, it manifests in a form of an illness. I'm not kidding. It's true. If you try to be calm, if you try to be nice, when you see that someone is cheating on you, or someone is definitely uh, fucking with your boundaries and your integrity of life, if you stay calm, it is going to manifest as a self-defeating thought, a self-consuming energy. Because you have stuck it in your body, in your brain, in yourself. You are not releasing that energy, okay? You are not expressing what you are feeling, you know? You, you, you are not, you're not claiming your boundaries. Dude, this is my fucking boundary. Don't try to fuck with me here, okay? So, that's why most of the nice people are actually sick. Because they always uh, say yes they never come they never bring out what they are feeling you know and it's not about just uh, shouting on someone else or just screaming it's about being relaxed you know there are two kinds of anger basically one is unhealthy anger and another one is healthy anger so basically what i'm talking about is healthy anger it's not about unhealthy anger okay it's not about just screaming and tensing yourself no that is unhealthy anger. That is a result, okay, let me explain it. That is a result of not expressing the anger. So that is not true anger at all, actually. Okay, you saw someone fighting and they couldn't breathe. They couldn't speak, you know, they tensed themselves. They couldn't speak, they started shaking and they, and they started uh, doing this crazy behavior. Uh, it also happened when you were debating in a, in a parliament. You see the people, they, they started increasing their, uh, their, their, their voice, you know. They, they, they increase their voice and sometimes they don't even know what they're saying, basically. They're just shouting. Versus another person who is angry and he is calm and he's breathing deeply from the belly and he's stating not shouting, but stating with firm uh, position, with a firmness, with a stillness, and his jaw is relaxed, so he's speaking very, in a very high, a very dense tone, but also, for example, like this. Dude, you did this wrong, okay? You are fucking with my boundaries. I want you to realize that, okay? Yeah, it's, it's not good. All right? So that's healthy anger. So you see, when I'm speaking, okay, when, when I was speaking, basically, my breathing was relaxed versus, dude, you're doing this wrong. You know, how can you do this? Oh. See, that's unhealthy anger. So there are two kinds of anger, basically. Healthy, unhealthy. And you got to always learn to express it in a healthy manner. You have to. If you haven't experienced it, if you haven't expressed it for years or decades, start doing it now. Okay, this is going to be amazing for your health, for your creativity, for your health, for, for your well-being, for your nice career, for your future. 
stand up man be an activist if something said wrong to you or if you see something some injustice going on take a stand but in a healthy surrendered accepted manner don't try to force it don't try to get overwhelmed by the emotions of anger feel it feel it through the body feel it fully feel it okay feel it through your arms your your arms your legs your jaw your face your neck feel this if there is any any tension and then express it it's almost like singing all right guys stay tuned i hope this helped for someone who's going through some hard times and are not able to express him his angers out so yeah more videos to come stay tuned bye bye